This is the demo of uh, Inventor Bow Connection. In this demo, I will insert a bow connection at the given point and will pattern the bow connection 12 times around the gasket. In order to do this, I just simply zoom closer to the gasket issue the command bolt connection. The bolt connection of Inventor is very easy to use. We need to verify the star face, the point where the connection gonna be inserted, and the termination phase where the bolt connection will stop. Step by step, I in I will select the star plane, select a point where the bolt connection will be inserted in, and my termination phase is the back of the green flange. Inventor will ultimately create two holes for me, one on the gasket and the second one on the flange. If I need to insert a bolt and washer in my connection I just simply click at this particular position to add the fastener. Let me illustrate it one more time. Star plane, the insertion point, the termination. I'm gonna click to add a fastener. I will do a heavy hexagon bolt after the bow, I like to have a washer. I click to add. I have multiple uh, washer that I can choose from, but in this case, I'm going to choose a plain washer. Inventor will ultimately give me the preview of the bow and the washer. If I like to add another washer and the bow, the nut on the other end, I will continue to click and add a washer and do one more time to add a hexagon nut. Inventor currently suggested that I use the bow size of 0.875 inches. The reason is suggested this size because there's some calculation involved. If I click on calculation, currently Inventor chose that just because on my axial force I have chosen 500 pounds. On my tangent force with the shear force I chose a thousand pound force. So therefore inventor suggest I use 0.875 inches. Assume that I'm going to go for a bigger force here that increase to 5,000 pound force and 6,000 shear force. What is the bow sign that I need to use? I simply click calculate it. Inventor will resize my bolt over here and give me a preview. And when it's done, it suggests that I should use a bow size of 2.25 inches. It's way too much for this. So I'm going to bring it down to a thousand and another five hundred on the shear force. For example, when I hit calculation, inventor will resize and suggest that I use 0.75. Let's increase to fifteen hundred on the shear force and do it one more time. Calculate it. Inventor will resize and suggest that I use one inch. I'm happy with that. I say okay. Inventor will ultimately insert a bow connection for me. The bow connection include the bow, the washer, and the nut on the other end. The next step 
that I'm going to do is to pattern the bolt connection around the gasket and multi multiply it by 12. Doing that, I'm going to invent the assembly using pattern. Select my bolt connection and I like to use a circular pattern. I verify the circular face. Increase the number to 12 and I like the spacing in between all of the equal to 360 degree divide by 12. I'm happy with that. I say OK. Now I have the connection and also the pattern of 12 connection around the gasket. This concludes the bolt connection generator of Inventive.